The cash register contains only $5 and $10 bills. It contains twice as many 5s as 10s, and the total amount of money in the cash register is $720. How many 10s are in the cash register? We need to begin by writing expressions for the number of 5s and the number of 10s. And since we're told the cash register contains twice as many 5s as 10s, we'll begin by letting x equal the number of $10 bills. And now from here, because there are twice as many 5s as 10s, if x is the number of $10 bills, then 2 times x, or 2x, represents the number of $5 bills. Notice how using these expressions, however many $10 bills there are, there will always be twice as many $5 bills. And now from here, because we know the total value is $720, we will write a value equation, which will be the value of a $10 bill times the number of $10 bills, plus the value of a $5 bill, times the number of $5 bills must equal the total value of all of the bills. So the value of the $10 bills is $10 times x, or 10 times x for our equation, plus the value of the $5 bills is going to be $5 times 2x, or 5 times 2x, and this must equal the total value of $720, or for our equation, 720. And now we need to solve for x. On the left, 10 times x is 10x, plus 5 times 2x is 10x. And now combining like terms, 10x plus 10x is 20x. 20x is equal to 720. The last step to solve for x is to divide both sides by 20. Simplifying, 20 divided by 20 simplifies to 1. 1 times x is x. We have x is equal to 720 divided by 20, which is equal to 36. Now that we know that x is equal to 36, we know the cash register has 36 $10 bills, which is what the question is asking. But let's also determine the number of $5 bills. The number of $5 bills is equal to 2x, where x is equal to 36. Substituting 36 for x, we have 2 times 36, which is equal to 72. There are also 72 $5 bills in the cash register. But again, the only question is how many 10s are in the cash register. So now we know there are 36 $10 bills in the cash register. Before we go though, let's verify if we have 36 $10 bills and 72 $5 bills, the value is $720. So let's verify that $10 times 36 plus $5 times 72 does equal $720. And notice it does, verifying our solution is correct. I hope you found this helpful.